as a society need to have a collective reckoning with the notion of heroes. As I warned, a monster we were told was cured has returned to wreak havoc, and Spider-Man failed to protect us. Once again, Dr. Kurt Connors, the lizard, rampages through our streets. The good doctor drags Spider-Man around town in one of the most pathetic displays of heroism I've ever witnessed. Was it heroic to destroy priceless artifacts in the museum? Was it heroic to demolish city blocks, damaging infrastructure, and costing taxpayers millions? What about the dozens of law enforcement officers injured trying to solve a problem Spider-Man created? Of course, he wasn't alone in this panoply of parlousness. The hunters continue to run roughshod, unchecked and unheeded. The level of devastation brought upon the denizens of this fair city is too much to bear. We've had enough! When will our elected officials step up and do their jobs? We can't keep waiting! By then, it will be too late. I was hoping to give MJ some alone time, but I'm beat. Time to head home for a little rest. Wonder what she decided for her article. Uh, forgot to wash the sheets at the house again. Talk about weak. Uh, oh, I can't stop yawning. I'm either tired, hungry, or both. Time to head home.
Dana Cogs, did uh, anyone happen to lose a 60-foot lizard? No? Because the city of New York just did. Seriously, it's just gone. And you want to know the spooky thing? Two people went into that sewer, Lizard and Spider-Man, but only one came out. So what happened in there? What did Spider-Man do? <sighs> Folks, look, I know I sound like he who must not be named, <coughs> Jonah. <coughs> and believe me, I, I feel just as hinky about that as you do, but we trust Spider-Man to look out for us, to do it the right way. What if he starts doing it the wrong way? What then? I'm sorry to get dark, folks, but those are the times. So let's all hope whatever journey Spider-Man is on, he finds his way back to the light. What you got, fake Mysterio?
Betsy called again? Let's see what she had to say. Hello, Spider-Man. Um, I just wanted to let you know that Quinn has agreed to enter some court-monitored counseling to help him with his post-prison transition. Finally. Cole, please be respectful. He's been through a lot. Sorry. I'm just... I'm just glad he's getting help, you know? Anyway, Quinn asked me to pass this along. He thinks he's close to figuring out what's going on. So just keep up the good work, Spider-Man. Good on Beck for going into counseling. We all need help sometimes. Watch out for those hunters. I've been dying to check out that place. It's getting crazy. keep the truck stable until it's ready to unload. They save my butt every time. That's the story I was telling you about. I wanted to get your thoughts. Looks amazing, MJ. Can't wait to read it. Wait, you're still in the suit. I thought Connors was gonna help you get it off. What about Harry? Sorry, can we do this tomorrow? Just so beat from Lizard Rag thing.
can't have that many guns. Stairs is my only shot. Where are you, Peter? Hey, you've reached Peter. Ah, <sighs> uh, it's good enough. Leave a message. Not just the spider living here. We've got if they've got the front and back covered, maybe I can go through the basement. Please don't squeak. Oh, thank you. Pete's workbench. Web shooters? Perfect. Boy, freeze. Get out. 